Um, do you want to talk a little bit about just like how scar tissue can affect C-section healing and just what that means for a lot of women who are trying to get active again? Yeah, so that's a, something very common too that people will say like, okay, we had the baby C-section, taking care of everything, feeling good. But over time, the scar needs to adhere down in order to heal, but it can adhere into your muscular layers, into your organ layers, and that can affect your bowel and bladder function. It can affect your digestion. It can affect your movement. So if you're having back pain or shoulder pain, it could be because all of that abdominal fascia is like getting pulled in and tight in that scar tissue. And I see moms years out even because the scar tissue can continue to develop for at least two years after a c-section so it's something you want to be aware of immediately you want to understand and like how you can get it moving and like right immediately postpartum with some breath work and then once it's fully healed you can touch the scar directly but then years later you want to make sure that you're still making sure that that abdominal fascia can move because a lot of times people come in, they're like, I'm getting a UTI, I'm getting a UTI. They're not having positive UTI tests, but that fascia is so tight and their pelvic floor consequently gets tight because their core isn't picking in well enough to provide healthy pressure and environment. Right, yeah. 